Brin cosmology refers to several theories in particle physics and cosmology related to string theory, superstring theory and M-theory. <laughs> Brin and bulk The central idea is that the visible, three-dimensional universe is restricted to a brin inside a higher dimensional space, called the bulk, also known as hyperspace. If the additional dimensions are compact, then the observed universe contains the extra dimension, and then no reference to the bulk is appropriate. In the bulk model, at least some of the extra dimensions are extensive, possibly infinite, and other brins may be moving through this bulk. Interactions with the bulk, and possibly with other brins, can influence our brin and thus introduce effects not seen in more standard cosmological models. <laughs> Why gravity is weak and the cosmological constant is small Some versions of Brin cosmology, based on the large extra dimension idea, can explain the weakness of gravity relative to the other fundamental forces of nature, thus solving the hierarchy problem. In the Brin picture, the electromagnetic, weak and strong nuclear force are localized on the Brin, but gravity has no such constraint and propagates on the full spacetime, called bulk. Much of the gravitational attractive power leaks into the bulk. As a consequence, the force of gravity should appear significantly stronger on small subatomic or at least submillimeter scales, where less gravitational force has leaked. Various experiments are currently underway to test this. Extensions of the large extra dimension idea with supersymmetry in the bulk appears to be promising in addressing the so-called cosmological constant problem. Topic. Models of Brin cosmology One of the earliest documented attempts to apply Brin cosmology as part of a conceptual theory is dated to 1983. The authors discussed the possibility that the universe has 3 plus n plus 1 display style 3 plus n plus 1 dimensions, but ordinary particles are confined in a potential well which is narrow along n spatial directions and flat along three others, and proposed a particular five-dimensional model. In 1998–99 Marab Gogbarashvili published on Archive a number of articles where he showed that if the universe is considered as a thin shell a mathematical synonym for brin, Expanding in five-dimensional space then there is a possibility to obtain one scale for particle theory corresponding to the five-dimensional cosmological constant and universe thickness, and thus to solve the hierarchy problem. It was also shown that the four-dimensionality of the universe is the result of the stability requirement found in mathematics since the extra component of the Einstein field equations giving the confined solution for matter fields coincides with one of the conditions of stability. In 1999 there were proposed the closely related randall sundrum scenarios, 1 rupee and 2 rupees, see randall sundrum model for a non-technical explanation of 1 rupee. These particular models of Brin cosmology have attracted a considerable amount of attention. Later, the pre-Big Bang, ekpyrotic and cyclic proposals appeared. The ekpyrotic theory hypothesizes that the origin of the observable universe occurred when two parallel Brins collided. Empirical tests As of now, no experimental or observational evidence of large extra dimensions, as required by the randall sundrum models, has been reported. An analysis of results from the Large Hadron Collider in December 2010 severely constrains the black holes produced in theories with large extra dimensions. The recent multi-messenger gravitational wave event GW170817 has also been used to put weak limits on large extra dimensions. See also Kaluza-Klein theory Loop quantum cosmology